So he's very sensitive here on this ulcer. Yeah, so I'm gonna numb this now, okay? And I'm gonna clean all this out and bandage it up, okay? Okay. Okay, so we have Richard here. Hi, Richard. So we're gonna do his nails. You're diabetic, right? Yes. Richard, okay, tell me how your diabetes are doing. Mm -hmm. Doing okay? The diabetes is fine. I take the insulin. Insulin, okay. No. Pretty well controlled? What? Pretty well controlled? I, I don't understand. Is it uh, diabetes pretty well controlled? Yes. Oh, okay, okay. So what, what do they usually run every day? How much insulin are you taking? None. Oh, none right now? None. Oh, okay. You say you just took uh, some insulin every day, right? No, I take no insulin. Oh, you don't, you take no insulin. Oh, I'm sorry. None. Okay, none. good, Zero. good. So what do you take? You take some pills or? Yeah, metformin. Oh, metformin, okay. That's good. And what else? I don't know yet. I'm sorry? I have to ask my wife. Hmm? Why don't you take me on that? You okay there? This part's okay? Yep. So you're telling me that your wife's been cutting your nails, right? Yes. And then she... she she creates some you bleeding. Really yeah, she used the grinder, huh? Yeah. You can see right here that it's got some blood in it. Yes. So she she uh, so, uh, she got a little too excited. Yeah. How often does she work on your nails? Today. Oh, she did. Yeah. Knowing that you're coming to see me. Yes. Really? <laughs> Why is that? Why is that? I don't know. You'd have to ask her. Oh, is that? Okay, I'm gonna ask her. Um, next time, tell her to. To leave some work for me, okay? Yes. Mm -hmm. There's still some blood underneath this um, nail here. What, the first one? Yeah, the... the, the, the... Uh, that shouldn't have any... There's just a big fat nail. Big fat nail, yeah. It's, yeah, it's very thick. Yes. For sure. Yeah. It looks like you have a lot of fungus in here, so I'm gonna oh, okay. send these um, out to get some um, tests done. Okay, see if they're fungus. Okay. That's good. Yeah. It looks it looks like fungus. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised. Mm -hmm. Are you taking blood thinner? Yes. Oh, you are, huh? Yeah. So I can tell. Okay, so we'll grind this down real nicely, okay? Yes. So how long you been diabetic? Uh, a couple of years. Just a couple of years? Okay. Pretty recent then, huh? Yes. Yeah. I can tell you're on blood thinner because My blood is thin. Yeah, it, it, it just bleeds, you know, everything I touch, you're bleeding. Uh, and same thing here, too. Uh, this is the one your wife was trying to cut? Yes, and that was the one that has... Some blood on it, huh? Gout. Well, this, is it. this one has a gout. Yeah. Oh, really? Does it get swollen, I I've think? I've had it for years. I never knew what it was. Oh, really? Okay. That's a, oh God, yeah, mm. that's a new. That's painful, huh? Whoa. Yeah, sometimes I have to put people in hospitals. Yeah, I can believe it. Yeah. So you want a special, like a diet that does the, for the gout? I don't know what you're talking about. Like special, like uh, things you uh, avoid. Yeah, like beer. Is that beer? <laughs> Do you not drink beer anymore? No. No? No. No, I, I have some pills for the gout. Uh-huh. Carl Coca-Cola. Coca 
Quercetin. Oh, Quercetin? Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. So how often do you take those? Whenever I need it. Whenever I need it. You feel something coming on? Yeah, but it's time for you often. Oh, is that right? Oh, that's good. Yeah. It's actually good. Hmm? Because now it's no joke. Yeah. You get it in the ankle. Uh-huh. Oh. oh, get him in the ankle too? Which one? The left. I, I, uh... I told the doctor about it. Mm-hmm. And he said, well, come in. He said, fuck you, I don't know. Uh huh. I thought, you know, when you're in the car and you're driving, you think, should I break or not? What? Should I put on the brakes? Uh huh. Or not? You can't step on that foot. Uh huh. So he's bleeding here because uh, he's on blood thinner. So, but I couldn't find the silver nitrate stick, which stops bleeding. So now we need to resume our session. I don't want him to keep bleeding too much. It's when you're on a blood thinner, you tend to um, bleed quite a bit. Any kind of little cut can make it bleed a lot. Usually people don't. So. Same thing happened here when his wife was trying to, um... His wife the mad scientist. Huh? His wife the mad scientist. <laughs> She's trying to help you. Yeah. All right? You can't deny it. Uh, so we'll get it down as much as possible. And then we're going to send it up to, uh... Um, send it up to the laboratory to uh, see if we can uh, see it. Is that tender? Uh, yeah. She just did it too, huh? Yeah. Yes, she just did it. So it's pretty tender for him. Okay. Now what we're gonna do is see he's very sensitive here no, on this no, ulcer. No, no. Is, it, yeah, so I'm gonna numb this now, okay? And I'm gonna yeah. clean all this out and bandage it up, okay? Okay. So when you're in the hospital, when you're lying down here, it uh, rubbed on it, wow. and you had a little spur there. So it had a little sharp edge right there. I'll show you the X-rays. Yeah, here's Richard's x-ray. You can see on the back of the heel here, there's a little sharp area and that's where it caused the rubbing. And that's why he created the um, bed sore here at the hospital. So now um, you can see that it translates to right here. So that sometimes that spur is pretty sharp and then it's rubbing there causing this whole area to open up. So he's very sensitive here. So I need to numb it up and then I'm gonna clean this up after okay so he richard has a, a, a ulcer here that he got from hospital right yeah i think it came from not only the hospital the bed but the, all the food you were eating there right well i don't know about that <laughs> i haven't had any of it since then. right so i just numbed it because he was very sensitive so it's a little bleeding up top here so tell us all the the great stuff you ate at the hospital. You're talking mm -hmm. about hospital food, right? Yeah. You're diabetic, and then they they gave you all kinds of stuff. Yeah. Right. Tell us what you were eating there. Uh, I tried to forget. Really? <laughs> right. So nasty. Yeah, the hospital. Yeah, you, know, you think they give you things like Chinese food that doesn't have all the carbohydrates? Uh-huh. 
So you're diabetic, so they, they're supposed to give you anti-diabetes diet, right? Yeah. So that, but that's not what happened? No. They give you diabetes celebratory food. <laughs> Yeah. But nasty. Uh, Did they give you jellos? Yeah. They're famous for their jellos. No, I don't think it had much jellos. Oh, really? Yeah. I the, can remember having them before, though. Right. They they all and talk about like the it. they all talk about the jellos. Yeah, the jello was good. It was. Yeah, the, when I had it. Oh, really? And then what else was uh, good there that you remember? Oh, well, you yeah. Uh, Milk, which is okay. Uh-huh. Coffee. Coffee? Yeah. Uh-huh. With like a sweet and low or something? No, uh, well, you could have sweet and low, but I just drink it black. Oh, you do? Okay, good. Yeah. Because all the other stuff's not good for you. You know that, right? Right. Like sweet and low oh, and Jesus. aspartame and all those things. Oh, all those colorful little sugar packets, not good for you, right? They're all artificial, not good for you. It doesn't raise your sugar, but it does other terrible things to your body. Yeah. So you 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 you're doing good just drinking black. Yeah, uh, I like it. Uh huh. Black. Uh huh. Okay, so this ulcer is gonna take some time. What I'd like you to do at nighttime when you sleep, put a little pillow right right here, so you take the pressure off the yeah, the heel right. area. Okay. Okay. So that's important to stay off that area when you sleep, okay? That's because that's how you got yeah. it, right? Well, and, I can't and then I'm gonna give you some uh, prescription for some antibiotic cream to put on here okay. with a band-aid as well, okay? Okay. Okay. Very good. Very nice to see you. Thank you for allowing us to film you today. Sure. We'll see you next time, okay? Thank you, Richard. Okay.